so hello everyone welcome and welcome back to my channel today in this video i will be dis discussing some important multiple choice questions on electric voltage and current hope this video will benefit you so without any further delay let's see all the mcq questions one by one sir. here we have the very first one the balls are usually filled with chemical inactive nitrogen and iron gas too and here we have the option to increase the illumination of the bulb prolong the life of filament change the heat profile of the filament reduce the power consumption of the bulb so which of the statement is or are correct here and here we have the option 1 1 and 4 2 and 4 1 2 and 3 and 2 only so here the correct correct option is 2 only here so option 4 is correct here sir. and here we have the cube point for explanation and in a bulb when current passes through filament it produces light and heat both and metals like tungsten which are used as filament glowing brightly may oxidize at high temperatures if normal gases are filled inside the bulb and filling of inert gases like nitrogen and argon prevents oxidation of the filament and increase its life so statement 2 is correct since it increases the life so this it prolongs the life of the filament so option 2 means this statement is correct here so here option 4 is correct now here we have the next one a fuse wire is inserted in a option here we have live wire in the neutral wire in the earth wire and more than one of the above and none of the above so the correct option is a live wire here the fuse must be connected to the circuit in live wire and the appliances will still be linked to the high potential through the wire, live wire even though the fuse will melt if it is attached to a neutral wire when there is an excessive current flow as a result the appliances shocks everyone who tosses it so a fuse wire is inserted in live wire so the correct option is one here and here consider the following statement about the transformer the first one is the transformer is a voltage control device second one it is used in the distributions and transmission of direct current and third one the transformer works on the principle of Faraday's law of electromagnetic inductions and mutual inductance so here we have the correct option is this one and three the transformer is a voltage control device as well as the transformer works on the principle of Faraday's law of electromagnetic inductions and mutual inductance. Since transformer works on AC only, by chance if it is connected to DC, a transformer will ballast. So it is always connected in AC. So here, this statement of statement 1 and statement 3 are correct here. So statement 1 and 3, so this option 2 is correct here. So here you can read the further more information about the transformer here. And here in question number 4, property in which an increase in voltage across the terminal causing a drop in electric current. The first one is negative resistance, second one capacitance, third one conductance, fourth one is inductance, and fifth one not at all. Only four options will be asked. So here the correct option is negative resistance here. And here negative resistance is the property exhibited in some electrical devices in which an increase in voltage across the terminal causes a drop in electric current and this can either be a static or a differential or dynamic here and here we have the option capacitance conductance and inductance so for capacitance here capacitance is the ability of a system to store an electric charge and conductance is the measure of how easily electric flows through a certain path through an electric elements and it is absorbed as a positive resistance and inductance is a property of electric conductors to pose a change in the electric current falling through it. So for these questions, property in which an increase in voltage across the terminal causing a drop in electric current is here, the correct option is this one, negative resistance. Now in question number 5, the neutral wire in a domestic electric circuit has the color. So for the neutral wire, the correct option is here black. So for neutral wire in a domestic electric circuit, the color is black here. And here we have for earth, it is of green color, for live, it is of red, and for neutral, it is black here. And in the next question, which of the following is not based on the heating effect of current? The first one is electric heater, second one electric bulb with filament, third one electric iron, and here the fourth one is microwave so here the correct option is microwave here here a microwave oven uses microwave to heat food here and in this case a microwave micro oven the commonly used radio wave frequency is roughly 2500 megahertz about 2.5 gigahertz so here microwave 
is not based on the heating effect of current. Now we are in question number 7. A device used for converting AC to DC. So in order to convert AC into DC, a rectifier is used. And here transform is generally used to step up and step down the voltage. And here if you want to study more about the rectifier here, so here we have the two types, half wave rectifier and full wave rectifiers, you can read here. Now here in question number 8, which one of the following is not a conductor of electricity? First one is vinegar, second lime juice, third salt water and fourth one is the distilled waters. And here the correct option will be the distilled waters here. Here for the explanations, here these conduct electricity in the aqueous medium that is dissolved in water. And here to talk about vinegar, here vinegar is the common name of acetic acid. So it may also be asked what is the common name of vinegar. So vinegar is the common name of acetic acid and breaks into their ions in the aqueous solutions. And lime juice is made of citric acid and it breaks into the ions in the aqueous medium. And salt water is also broken into the ions in the aqueous mediums. And distilled water is free of salt. Means there is no salt in the distilled waters. It is free of salt and is a poor conductor of electricity. Obviously, in the absence of salt, it will be it will conduct the electricity. Sorry, it will conduct poorly. So it has the poor conductivity of, electri of electricity. Hence, it is clear that the distilled water is not a conductor of electricity. So for this. The distilled water means option 4 is correct here. And in question number 9, to which of the following field of science do Kirchhoff's rule belong? First one is atomic structure, electric circuit, organic chemistry and optics. So here the correct option is electric circuit. So Kirchhoff rules belongs to the electric circuit. And Kirchhoff rules, Kirchhoff loop rules explain the sum of all the electric potential difference nearly a loop is zero here. So here for this question the correct option is here electric circuit means option 2 here. Now in question number 10 electric wires are generally coated with first one is polypropylene, second one polyvinyl chloride, third one is polyurethane, fourth one is polyethylene. So here electric wires are generally coated with polyvinyl chloride. It means it is electric wires are coated with polyvinyl chloride and you may also be asked to write the full form of PVC. So just remember the full form of PVC is polyvinyl chloride. And now here we have the next one. Superconductors are substances which conduct electricity at low temperature, offer high resistance to the flow of current, offer no resistance to the flow of current and conduct electricity at high temperatures. So here the correct answer is offer no resistance to the flow of current. So offer no resistance to the flow of option 3 is correct here. And here we have the key points. Superconductors are the substance that have zero resistance at very low temperatures. So electricity flows through them rapidly. An example mercury below 4.2 K lead and lead below 7.25 K acts like superconductors. And here K is expressed in Kelvin. Now here we have the two weld. Question number 12 and how much work has to be done to transfer a charge of 3 column across 2 points having a potential difference of 10 volt. So here we have the charge of 3 column is given here and the potential difference B is given as 10 volt here. So we know the formula for work done is W is equals to B into Q. So if you multiply 3 into 10 we will get 30 joule here. So the work done has to be done in 30 joule has to be done is 30 joule. So 30 joule is the correct option. It means option 4 is correct here. Now in question number 13, in alternating current AC, the direct and magnitude of current varies. In AC, the alternating current AC, the directions and magnitude of current varies periodically here. Option 2 is correct here. So here in el the electric current flows in two ways. The first one is AC and the second one is direct current here. So in DC, you can see that the current flows directly it means it flows like unity signals and in alternating current here you can see the current is changing periodically here it means the electric current whose direction changes periodically is called as electric current and now in question number 14 here dash is the work done in moving a unit charge between two points in an electric circuit so here the correct option is here potential 
Here electric potential is worked on in moving a unit charge between two points in an electric circuit and it is measured in volt. And now in question number 15, thin wires of which of the following metal is used for making the filament of electric bulb. Option here we have tungsten, second option silver, third nichrome and fourth one is the copper. So here tungsten metal is used for making the filament of electric bulb. So here option one is correct here sir. And here, here are tungsten is used to make an electric bulb filament for the following reasons. Here we have here some properties are given. Sir. It is very high melting point being an alloy and it has very high resistance so it does not burn easily at room temperatures and the lamp glows at high temperatures and also tungsten filament does not melt even though a significant amount of heat is generated due to the passing of current through the filament through the heating effect of current so here for this question the correct option is a tungsten option one so this was all for today thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you